sort of uh, sequence to warm up before class or just to feel your body uh, tune in to different parts of your body more, especially the torso, shoulders, and hips. So going to start, knees up, and just lying on your back, might want to take a second just to feel how the body is feeling, what is and is not touching the floor. Then let both knees fall to one side. You want to really let them drop. Good, so here let that be really relaxed. And now I'm going to draw from the abdominals to come back in. So just letting that roll through and letting the legs follow. That's it, good. And let that go to the other side as well. So the rest of the sequence will be one-sided, but for this particular exercise, we'll do both sides. Good, and just let that peel through. That's right, good. And go ahead, do one more each side. And I would do four to eight reps, you know, possibly more if you're feeling it, for just getting in tune. That's it, good. And one more time. Good. Okay, that's great. Yes, good. So it's very luxurious pulling them through the center. Great. Now let that roll onto your side. And again, tucks in to help support the neck. So in this position, lying here, now going to bring head and foot up. So closing through the center here. Good, that's right, good. And your hand is supporting your neck so that there isn't a lot of strain in the neck. Then going to slowly lower this down and really let it be fully down, looking for the length through the sides. Can be a little quicker on the way up, that's it, good. But take your time on the way down to really feel that space happening. And again, you can do several reps of that. That's it, good, nice, good. Then leave your legs pretty much as they are, going to prop the upper arm, good, that's it. And now arch through the back, so pulling shoulder blade down again, that's right. And then going to pull arms and legs away from each other and contract, so coming into a curved shape. That's great. We're going to pull that out. That's it. Good. And then going to close it back in, so arching. Feet, heels move back towards your hips. That's right. Good. Nice. Good. And then pull that away. That's right. And really want to especially pull the arm out to really get the length all through the back here. That's great. Good. Then from there, you can tuck into a fetal position. Just tuck it in very tight. That's right, leading from the abs. Now going to let arm and leg reach away from each other. So legs sliding back a little bit toward me. That's right, good. And it's going to roll out to as far as you can comfortably go. I'm going to leave this leg on the floor. So for most people, it's not going to come completely onto the back. And again, drawing in through the abs, let it curl all the way back in. Good. And now send this toe back. That's right, good. And here, really want to think of the hip flexors gliding out away from the center. That's great, good. And then let that roll onto your back. Good. And going to bend your left leg, since we're staying on the left side here slides in. Good. Going to engage through the turnout muscles to lift your hip up so knee stays up. There's a squeeze into the, into the rotators here. Good. And let that come back down. Good. And do that one more time. Good. And again, you could do as many reps of all of these as you'd like. We're just going through the sequence quickly. That's it. Good. Good. Now take that onto your side again. Let this leg extend to the back. Other leg bends in. And arm is going to come forward. That's right. Good. And then going to swing. Leg to the front, arm to the back. Good. And then let it switch. And this is the one in the sequence that could move a little bit faster. So just letting this move through one, through the other. Again, it's all initiating from the torso. That's great. Good. Good. Beautiful. Good. And then just 
let that roll onto your back one more time. Good, let your leg down, feel the two sides. Hopefully, left side feeling a little bit longer than the right. And then when we continue the sequence, just starting over from the beginning and going through the whole sequence on the other side.